Alright, today we're heading down to Beatrice today. Gonna check out a roller rink down there called the Roll Arena. It's been down there for several, several years, but just never been down there with family. And I wanted to show you guys something. Yeah, you can see a little patch here. There used to be some PVC pipes popping up out of there. One here, two there, one there. Well, they decided to come out and everything and level it out because there was a big old hill here. And when the kids were playing and everything, they had to hop over it and they almost tripped and stubbed their toes and everything. So they decided, we decided to call them, complain about it, and they just came out and leveled it out. A, uh, an hour road trip down there, about 55 minutes is, is what Google Maps says. So um, I'm bringing my handheld down there because there are a few amateur reveal repeaters down there. I don't know if they're active. But, uh, park over there that's supposed to have an old antique tank that kids play on. I think it's called Chitaqua, Chitiqua Park. I'm not, I'm not sure how they pronounce it exactly. All right, well, we made it down to Beatrice in a little bit faster time than I thought. It probably only took about 38 minutes and everything. Uh, we were doing about 60, 70, 80 miles an hour at a time. I'm just, uh, we stopped over here at the uh, Capri Inn and Suites because Jeffrey wanted to film a few elevators. So he's in there doing that now. We're going to head over to the Walmart over there later. And then down to uh, the uh, place is called Roll Arena and everything. And it starts at 1 o'clock, so we got just over a half hour to kill. All right, this is the lobby of the arena. Someone said hi on the wall. Who did that one, huh? Yep. Okay, this is inside Rural Arena. Just uh, uh, don't worry about the music because they're going to be copywriting me and everything. They got a little birthday party over, over here. Birthday party area over here. Little benches here. I guess that was Roll Arena, at least uh, Tuesday afternoon in summer, and summer's just getting started, so I'm sure it's going to pick up in, in, in the next few weeks. Anyway, it's over to the park next, McDonald's, and then heading back home. Alright, well, we made it back home. No real problems or anything like that. It is uh, just after 5.40. Uh, we, we did have a little bit of a scare on the way back and everything going through Cortland uh, their main road through there the highway 77 goes right through the western part of Cortland there like you you could uh, hear hear the road going thump 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 almost like yeah, as if you had a flat tire pulled over the side of the road and everything because my wife was saying oh okay it sounds like we, have, we got a flat we got a blowout or something like that pulled over to the side of the road and we're just fine all four tires just fine. Uh, like I said, it's been a while since I've driven way down there in that area. So I kind of forgot how the uh, Department of Roads or the state of Nebraska put the uh, interstates. You know what? 
Oh, I forgot I left my radio in there. Let's try that again. Left my radio in here. We did bring up one repeater down there. Um, it was. I believe it was on a 140, it was a 146.49 with a PL tone of 127.8, it was CTCSS tone. It did come up, I, I did try the other 440s and the 146.79 with no tone, none of those came up. So, anyway, so Roll Arena will probably be back. Kids had fun, so thumbs up for them, right? Oh,